hour south of Nashville, Tennessee, at the concert hall here at our farm, the sun is going down and guitars are being tuned up. Join us for a half an hour of some of country music's greatest songwriters, stories, and songs, here on Mule Town and the Round. I want to do something he didn't cut before, just because I love this song a whole lot. And I wrote this with my buddy Trent Wilman. We wrote this song about, we were talking about all the places we played when we were young, you know, when they weren't that nice, but they had really good people and they had cold beer. And that's all that matters, right? And uh, the roof was leaking and the pool tables weren't level. <laughs> But uh, this is, and then we kind of turned it into a love song because you got to try to get it cut. It's got to be about more, right? That's right. <laughs> Here we go. Let's see if I can do it. It's called uh, Coldest Beer in Town. There's a neon sign that's flickering in the corn Smoke so thick a man could hardly breathe There's a jukebox full of hank and deep dear rings They're all worn out and broken just like me It's light is when we take this whole place to the ground The man they got the coldest beer in town It's the last place you'd expect to find redemption And there ain't It's as good a place as any If you need somewhere to drown Man, they got the coldest beer in town You can take your pick of a half a dozen bar stools no, there ain't a soul in here that knows her name There's an old man throwing messes at the dartboard And a bucket catching water when it rains No, I probably shouldn't have enough They got the coldest beer in town. It's the last place you'd expect to find redemption. And there ain't an angel nowhere to be found. But it's as good a place as any. Need somewhere to drown And they got the cold spear in town The kind of place I know I won't see you around And they got the cold spear in town Y'all very much. Hi everyone, this is David with Azure. Here at Azure, we believe in healthy and abundant living. We are dedicated to supplying healthy and organic food for 
an abundant lifestyle for you and your family at a price that your family can afford. I would love to personally invite you to become a part of the Azure family where you can create community around healthy food and healthy living. You know, to make a long story short, as I can, I got married to my wife, Garnet. Well, you left a lot out of that hole, didn't you? Know? <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes it's just nice. Just jumped just, over that. Just, just pull out. Yeah. And so I, uh, <laughs> anyway, um, we, we had come off our honeymoon. It was a great honeymoon. All right, you she don't got to go into detail about that. <laughs> well, you well anyway, I'm not. So we came back home, and I had my first writing session, and I was writing with Don Cook at a studio named Soundcheck. Anyway, when I went in there, I almost didn't go to this writing session, and Don Cook asked me, he said, so, how's marriage life? And I said, it's getting better all the time. I'll try to do it for you. Um. Well, I don't stop breathing every time the phone rings. My heart don't race when someone's at my door. Now I've almost given up thinking you're ever gonna call. I don't believe in magic anymore. I don't just lie awake at night asking God to get you off my mind. It's getting better on. Time. It's getting better all the time. Yeah, I got to work on time again this morning. This old job is all that I got left. And no one even noticed I'd been crying At least I don't have whiskey on my breath Well, I think I'm gonna make it Cause God won't make a mountain I can't climb it's getting better all the time It's getting better all the time God, I hope you're happy Girl, I Well, I always thought that I'd do something crazy If I ever saw you out with someone else But when the moment came last night I couldn't say a word I stood there in the dark all by myself well, I could have said a million things, but all I did was keep them locked inside. It's getting better all the time. It's getting better all the time. It's 
getting better all the time. Oh. What if you could learn how to grow your own food, raise chickens and milk cows, how to harvest, cook, can, and preserve, how to have babies at home and homeschool them as they grow, how to keep bees and start a flower garden, how to spin and weave wool, and even build, mostly a more sustainable life. Here at our farm an hour south of Nashville, we're bringing together some of the most influential speakers, teachers, musicians, and icons for a two-day event where you can learn not only how to grow your own food, but how to grow a life filled with meaning and purpose. And for my dear, beautiful wife out there, she's sitting over yonder, and she, uh, Garth was doing his big comeback record, you know, and uh, he, uh, I'd been to his ranch in 2007. We went out there, me and Brian Kennedy and Troy Jones went out there and did a little show for him, his buddy's birthday or his friend's birthday, and uh, so somehow at the end of the night. It was me and Gar sitting around the campfire. He said, man, we were sitting around playing old Haggard songs, you know, and he was in retirement and, you know, and we just said, it was, it was surreal, man. You sit around the campfire playing old Haggard songs with Garth Brooks, you know. And he said, man, play me something you wrote recently, you know. So I played him this song me and Chris Wallen had wrote like the day before. I fumbled my way through it and he goes, man, I really like it, you know. So. Seven years, eight years go by, and he's doing this record, and he had recorded this one song of mine on there, and he goes, man, send me that song you, you played me that night by the campfire. And I'm like, what? I don't know what that was, you know? <laughs> he said it was called Fish or something. I said, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I sent it to him, and he recorded that one. I thought, this is easy, you know? <laughs> so anyway... A few weeks go by, and he and he says, "Man, he texts me, and he said, "Man, I'm I'm going back in today, and I'm looking for a few more songs, you know, and I'm gonna cut one more time." And uh, so I'm sitting there, and I gotta go to Nashville and write with these boys. And I'm sitting at the kitchen table, and I got my laptop out there, and I'm going through my songs, you know. And, and my wife was over washing dishes, and uh, she said, "Send him this song here, you know." And I said. Uh, no, he ain't gonna like it. I'm looking for something here now. Just leave me alone. Let me do my thing. You know? <laughs> she said, I'm telling you, if you'll send him this one. I said, look, you know, hey, you know. Finally, she said, I'm telling you, he'll love it. And I said, look, you do what you do over there and let me do what I do. <laughs> and she, she wasn't, she's like a dog with a bone, so... She, she, I finally just said, all right, I'm going to send it to him if you'll hush about it. So I'm going to send it to him, you know. And about two hours later, I'm sitting in Nashville, and my phone rings, and it's Garth, and he's freaking out about this song she wanted me to send it. You know? <laughs> Which was bittersweet, you know. <laughs> Because I'm really glad. He said, man, I wish I'd had this song 20 years ago, you know. But now I got to call her <laughs> and tell her she was right, you know. And I, <clears throat> again. And uh, <laughs> me and my buddy Don Sams wrote this out to Cabin one day. A little baby told God. I'm kind of scared Don't know if I 
wanna go down there From here it looks like a little blue ball But it's a great big place And I'm so small Why can't I just stay here with you? Did I make you mad? Don't you want me to? God said, old child, of course I do. But I've got a life all planned for you. So hush now, little baby, don't you cry. There's someone down there waiting whose only goal in life making sure you're always gonna be all right a loving angel tender tough and strong it's almost time to go and meet your mom now you'll never have a better friend touch to tuck you in she'll kiss your bruises your bumps and scrapes and every time you hurt her heart's gonna break so hush now little baby don't you cry there's someone down there waiting whose only goal in life Making sure you're always gonna be all right. A loving angel, tender, tough, and strong. It's almost time to go and meet your mom. And when she's talking to you, make sure you listen close. She's gonna teach you everything. Like how to mind your manners To love and laugh and dream And she'll put you on the path That'll bring you home to me So hush now, little baby Don't you cry There's someone down there waiting Whose only goal in life Making sure you're always gonna be all right. A loving angel, tender, tough, and strong. Come on, child, it's time to meet your mom. There you go. There's an incredible company called Azure Standard. I've been having an incredible trip out here in Oregon, learning so much about it. This is a place where you can get so much of what you need with your food and know that it's, it's coming from a truly organic and healthy place. They want families to be able to eat food as it's meant to be enjoyed. It's really amazing. You can go to azurestandard.com. I've been really blessed by what I've been learning, so check it out. Thank you all very much, Win. I had a good time today. Oh, y'all, thank you, y'all my brothers. Fun. Thank you all so much, all right? Love you, Ronnie Bowman.
Nobody sins, nobody wins in a fight. And sometimes wrong is right. And some of it learn the hard way, some of it read on a page, some of it comes from heartbreak, most of it comes with age. Ever comes easy, but maybe can't use them. No, I don't probably know what to think to do, but there's something to some. Girls like to laugh. Tears don't last, it scares what praying is for. When it's close, swing the bat, everybody's got a past that love's worth living for. When you dance, hold it close till it breaks, go for gold. Be the first to reach for hand. No, you don't get to do some things. Some of them learn the hard way, some of read on the page, some comes from heartbreak, most of it comes with age, and none of them ever comes easy, but maybe can't use them, no, I don't probably know what to think of something to someone When we can't take it slow It's time to show It really makes you a man It's being true to her too Glass runs out of sand. And some of them learn the hard way, some read on a page, some comes from heartbreak, most of it comes with age, and none of it ever comes easy, but maybe can't you? Something to some some of it. Yeah. Thank you all very much. Thank you, Jeff Hyde, Bobby Pinson. All right. All right. Thank you all.